Nice. It may look like fun and games, but Matt Steele has to be careful, even around his kids. Matt has multiple myeloma, a cancer that affects his immune system and leaves him vulnerable to infections. In fact, Matt occasionally has to go to the emergency department for care. With me, it could be anything. Uh, with my immune system, with, you know, being so low, I can... I get a little bit of everything. My kids share every germ they bring home, of course. Matt isn't alone. Cancer patients often go to a general ED, but a new approach is changing that. The new James Cancer Hospital and Solov Research Institute at The Ohio State University is the first in the nation to have a cancer ED integrated with a regular ED. Based on my 32 years of experience in providing emergency care, uh, patients with cancer conditions do more frequently visit the emergency department because things do come up. 24 hours a day, 365 days a year for them. Patients like Matt who have compromised immune systems often worry about being around others who are sick. So to cut the risk of infection, cancer patients at Ohio State skip the waiting room and go to a unit designed for their needs. Here, experts trained in both emergency and cancer medicine assess and treat their emergencies. We want to have a, a pre-identified guideline that spells out what we want to do for those patients so that there's no uncertainty when you arrive. Turndrip says this new field of emergency cancer medicine offers personalized care that other EDs are expected to adopt in the future. Knowing it's there, that I don't have to worry about picking up an extra germ. Uh, the doctors and nurses are going to know about my situation a little better. It's wonderful knowing they have an ER there just for the cancer patients. At Ohio State's James Cancer Hospital and Solov Research Institute, this is Clark Powell reporting.